to a new weekly vlog. Today is the 24th. We didn't vlog and I didn't do any videos last week. Um, Will was actually in ICU. His blood pressure got out of control and it was just a big to-do. But he is a lot better this week, so it's back to film and I just actually filmed four videos and I'm starting a new vlog. Um, did some laundry, getting some things around the house done. We have to go mail off some packages for Poshmark and Mercari. But if we do anything else, and you know it's just a Monday, but if anything else happens, I'll take y'all along with us. And hopefully it'll be back to longer vlogs this week now that things are kind of getting back to normal. So be ready to hopefully have an adventurous week with us. So Will and I just got back from town. I figured I'd do a quick little grocery haul before I put them away. Um, not a lot of stuff, just a few things, um, some pepperoni pizza rolls, just a good, something quick to pop in the oven, some hash browns, some ketchup, these are some little churro dippers, I've never had them, but they look like little little churros, just a little snack, um, some Canadian bacon, some Louisiana jalapenos, some potato salad, some Crisco cooking oil, some, um, a pack of these Starskis Tuna Creations and Ranch, pack of the El Paso Southwest Season Tortillas, and some Velveeta Mac and Cheese. These are the cups. These are for Will. He really likes the Mac and Cheese. As you can tell, because he also picked up some um, box Mac and Cheese. But yeah, that's it. Like I said, not a lot. Um, I didn't really film in the store because we weren't picking up a lot. But I think I'm going to edit. And I don't think I'll be doing anything else today. But if I do, I'll check in. Hey everyone, welcome back to the vlog. Today's Tuesday. Um, I didn't really do much yesterday. I showed y'all. Um, we went to the grocery store and I kind of hauled what we got. But I didn't do anything after that. I just kind of took a shower and I sat down and edited. Um, we're on our way to the city today. I'm not sure what all we're going to do when we're down there. But I'll film, you know, what I can. I know Will wants to visit some people and drop off vegetables first. So that's something we'll do before we head down there. Um, sometime, probably this afternoon while I have makeup on. Because I don't know if... I like to go ahead and film when I have my makeup on. Because I don't know if I'm going to feel like putting on a full face of makeup again. But I think this afternoon I'm going to film my monthly favorites and fails because I kind of already pulled that out um, before we left that way everything is set up and ready when we get back I can just sit down and film it but other than that I think that's all we're going to do today okay well we'll change the shirt because he threw up yeah. um we just left Target, didn't really get anything, but, um, school supplies are out, and I picked up this cute notebook, it's pink, and it has gold and blue anchors on it, um, y'all know we're having the Carnival Cruise wedding, and we're having a cruise before the cruise wedding, so just to kind of, you know, organize our thoughts and questions that we have for Carnival, and just... You know, packing list. I figured this would come in handy. This was two fifty, and then also Kai. I filmed a little bit in the store last year, and even early this year, they had all glitter stuff. It was like nothing but glitter stuff, and it was all on clearance. Well, now they're doing like actual makeup. I'm not really sure what's going on with that brand because their Instagram looks like it was controlled by like a thirteen-year-old girl at one point. But now they have actual makeup. I showed y'all in the store. They had foundation, contour stuff. They had they had a, a good bit of everything. Would you say? Um, I picked up one of their um, 
matte lip creams and this is just a nude color it's called bear it all and it's C10181 it's just you know a pinky nude color I'll swatch it later I don't have makeup wipes right now but you know just a basic nude color these were three dollars and the actual lipsticks were four but I figured I would pick it up and actually try something that wasn't glitter related from the brand um I think we're gonna go to Goodwill and maybe maybe do the husband buys my outfit challenge yeah you wanna do that? Okay. I think we're gonna go do that before we go back to like Kenner and stuff so yeah when I had you to myself I didn't want you around those pretty faces always made you stand out in a crowd but someone picked you from the bunch when the glass was all it took now it's much too late for me to take a second look oh baby give me one more chance oh, something else but I think I'm gonna end up doing a haul because I know we're gonna go to Burlington now before we grab dinner and maybe Dollar Tree but we'll see how Will's feeling so we'll check in okay we're going into Burlington Smashbox at Burlington and it's marked down They have so much crumb shop at Burlington, y'all. Jumbo. That's one of our absolute favorite Chinese buffets in um, the like Kenner Metairie area. They have really, really awesome sushi. That's the main reason. I guess one of the main factors of how me and Will pick where we eat Chinese because we both really like sushi. But we went in Dollar Tree because when we were in Gulf Court, we went to the Dollar Tree and I smelled these um, Old Williamsburg Colombian Cold Brew Scented Candles. They're the ones that have the little 
look like the little Starbucks coffees. I smelled it in Gulfport and I had it in my hand to check out and I put it up and I regretted it and I've been looking for it since and I couldn't find it anywhere like around Hammond or anywhere but I found them today and Will can tell you I'm not even a big coffee drinker but they, they just have a good aroma like it's yeah not, it's not so much like just like coffee beans it's like a I don't know how to explain it. it. It's a good, it's just a good smell. Yeah, like, good it smell. smells like Starbucks. Yeah, yeah it was like a, It smells a, like you walked into a coffee a shop. Smooth. So I picked up two of them in case I can't find them again. But the old Williamsburg in general, they have, they put off a really good throw. And they're only a dollar. So if you see these, pick them up, give them a try. If I see them again, I'll probably buy more than two because I'll probably burn through these really quick. But yeah, really, really good. Um, now we're going to go eat and then probably head back home, so that's it. Okay, so we're back from the city. I lit the um, Colombian coffee candle, so I'll keep y'all updated on it. Um, I'm about to sit down and film my favorites and fails, but I want to show y'all how that Kai lipstick that I got from Target swatches first. Okay, so this was it. Super basic packaging. Um, it's kind of dark. I have my ring light on because it's dark outside, so I'm going to swatch it. Okay, that's how it's swatched. Really, really, really pretty basic nude color. It does smell really, really fruity. It smells exactly like Fruity Pebbles. That's the best thing I could say to describe it. So if you're into scented lips, um, wouldn't recommend it. But yeah, it was only $3 at Target. Really pretty nude color. Definitely check it out if you're interested in seeing a new brand. Okay, so Will and I are back from New Orleans. Um, We finished filming the second half to the Husband buys my outfits from Goodwill. Um, I also filmed my monthly favorites and fails, so that'll be that'll be up the day before you see this vlog. But I don't think I'm gonna do anything else for the rest of the night. I think I'm gonna go take a shower and then watch the newest episode of Grand Hotel. But yeah, other than that, nothing else really planned for the day. So I'll check in with y'all tomorrow which will be Wednesday, so see you then. Hey everyone, today is Wednesday. We are going to the post office. We have some orders to send off for Poshmark. I'm not sure what else we're going to do, but we'll take y'all with us. Oh, baby, give me one more chance. Oh, this really cool checkered one but the shirts are really really cute and tropical i was telling will to get one for the crease it has bananas and they have this pattern over here that's like skull island type of thing with shark fins and they have one with parrots that's really really cool cactuses super super cute the shirts are um more expensive though the shirts are $13.46 but super super cool I want him to get the banana one for the cruise but he doesn't want to so I'll have to pick it up without him oh and they have a flamingo one forgot the flamingo one
Okay, so we just left Dirt Cheap, got a little bit of footage in the store, but um, back to school supplies are out. I picked up this really, really cute backpack. This was 50% off. I got it because it's super, super tropical looking. And anytime we go on a cruise, I like to have a backpack just for when, you know, when we get off at the different ports. We have something to throw, you know, like our towel, sunscreen, things like that in for the day. And Will tried it on. He said it's super comfortable, that it would work. And it's the Embark brand, so just, you know, a basic backpack. And we also picked up some just five-star um, blue folders. For our wedding cruise, we're not doing traditional favors. We're doing like welcome bags. So each cabin is going to have a bag and it's going to be filled with like itinerary, sunscreen, diff different things like that that you'll need on the cruise. So I picked this up just to hold the itineraries and like list of room numbers and stuff for all of our guests. These were 10 cents a piece, so really good deal. Back from Walmart, so just a quick little grocery haul. As I put stuff away, sorry if you don't like the sound of the bag, just fast forward, but this is real life putting groceries up. Um, we got some of the Great Value restaurant style um, white corn tortilla chips. These are for chicken nachos tonight. We got just some um, Great Value hamburger rolls, buns, whatever you want to call them, because Will wants burgers one night. Also picked up this. This is the first time I've ever saw these. These are by Dole, and they are the, um, they had two types. They had the original and the protein, but these are, um, the acai bowls. I'll have to check in and try, try it and let y'all know if they are worth it. Of course, it's not going to focus. Um, no, I'm good. You're leaving me? Yep. We got some, just some suave two-in-one shampoo. Hey! Picked up some more of the Spring Valley Ginger Root tablets. Y'all know these are amazing for um, prepping for a cruise. I like to take them every day because they just help with digestion. Um, they do say digestive health. Picked up some eggs, just large white eggs. A five pound bag of the Great Value Boneless Skinless Chicken Breast, again for chicken nachos tonight. I know I showed y'all the buggy in the store, but we ended up picking up more stuff. Um, some guacamole Takis. These are the best Takis. These are the only Takis I will eat. I love guacamole anything. Some um, organic blueberries. Some Yopla yogurt. This is the strawberry cheesecake. But we also got... Well, Will picked up one and I picked up one. Will picked up the Boston cream. He likes that flavor. Some just great value queso for the nachos tonight. Some chocolate chip cookies because we need a sweet treat. Some just frozen corn, great value brand. Some California vegetable mix. Some beef burgers, great value. Nice big watermelon and two gallons of water. Y'all know we prefer the gallons over the bottles just because it's easy during the summer to pour into a tumbler. But that's it. I'm going to pick all this up and check in with y'all after that. Hey everyone, it is Thursday. It's almost 3 o'clock. I didn't really vlog anything this morning because Will had his um, monthly clinic appointment for dialysis. Going to the damn doctor. So um, we got that out of the way this morning. Now we're going to drop off packages for Poshmark and then we're going to go to his sister's and swim. But on the way out, I wanted to show y'all. Hopefully, I can get a better view from this side when we leave the house. But they're actually, we live um, by like a big wedding barn venue. And this morning, there, well, this afternoon, they've been there all day. They're filming um, a movie or something there, so I was going to show y'all how crazy it is. I see a bunch of cars. 
and there's the barn wedding venue, but they have the new venue, which is the greenery, which is over here, which is where they have all these, like, white, wheels going too fast, trailers and stuff. All those production trailers. Welcome back to the vlog. It's Friday. It's just about 5 o'clock. We did have plans today to go to Bat Rouge to do some shopping, but as y'all can see, it's raining, it's nasty, the weather's a mess. And Will went and saw his mama, went and saw my mom. And by the time, you know, we did all that, it was a late morning. We just, you know, just would rather have an easy night at home instead of going all the way to Baton Rouge. So, we are on our way to drop off some packages from Mercari. And then we're going to go to Walmart and pick up some stuff because we want to do, well, Will wants to do breakfast for dinner. Just make it easy, which that sounds pretty good. We haven't done that in a while. So... Um, we'll just catch up in Walmart. Okay, so we're back home. Sorry it's a little dark. I'm working natural light right in front of the window. Um, I know I said I would show y'all in Walmart, but we were just quick in and out. Grabbed what we needed and got out of there. Will is doing dinner right now. And I think it's pretty much going to be a lazy night. If anything interesting happens, we'll check in. Hey everyone, welcome back to the vlog. Today is Saturday. Haven't really done too much of anything today, but I need to get started cleaning, and I actually want to show y'all what I'm going to do because it's more like throwing out an organization. So let me go ahead and show y'all what I plan on doing. Okay, so this is just a little jewelry organizer from Five Below, and I want to go through it and just organize because the majority of this I'm not wearing, so I want to go through, I want to clean this out. All these clothes right here need to be put away. I need to ju ju just go ahead and go through the dresser, organize, pull out stuff for the yard sale, and I've started, hey there's me, I don't know if y'all can see, but I've started writing my to-do list on the mirror because it is in my way. I have to see it. I have to look at it. Therefore, I have to get it done. So, that's a new strategy that I have going there. But, um, also have to clean all these makeup brushes, clean my vanity. And just an update, I ate the uh, dull acai bowl for breakfast this morning. It was not my favorite. I probably won't repurchase it. It was like $2 at Walmart. But um, I just, I didn't care for all the blueberries. But if you like acai bowls and want to try it, you could try it. But anyway, I was going to film today, but I have so much just cleaning and basic organizational stuff that I need to get done. I'll probably make tomorrow, which is Sunday, my filming day. Um, I don't even know if that'll happen yet. I might end up filming Monday. But um, like I said, I'm just going to be cleaning and organizing today. It's Saturday. It's almost like 4 o'clock. I know I'm getting a late start. But it was one of those days, have y'all ever had them where you get up with so much energy and you're like, I'm going to do this, this, and this. And then it's like, <laughs> I'm going to do nothing but binge watch TV and then get started in the afternoon. That's kind of what happened today. But yeah, I'll um, maybe show y'all some shots of me organizing and just how I organize and clean. But if anything interesting happens, I'll check in. Okay, so I was able to get six of the little compartments emptied and all the jewelry is better organized now. So I have some more room. This is everything that I'm getting rid of. Quite a bit, pretty proud of it. Lots of bracelets, earrings, and rings. Now on to the next task. Okay, I'm done cleaning for the day. I think that's everything I'm gonna do. I'll check back in with y'all tomorrow, which will be Sunday, and hopefully, I said I was going to film tomorrow, but I made another to-do list, so it'll probably be another cleaning day, but I'll take y'all along with me in whatever I decide to do. Hey everyone, today is Sunday. It's going to be another, you know, cleaning, getting things done around the house type of day, 
But I want to show y'all, I was going to film what I picked up when we were in New Orleans at TJ Maxx in Burlington. But I figured, you know, it's really not a lot of stuff, so I'm just going to go ahead and show y'all here in the vlog. Okay, so I'm just going to start with TJ Maxx. Only picked up two things from there, like I did with Burlington. Um, it was these Crim Shop turmeric face mask, and this was a pack of five for $3.99. Y'all know I've said it so many times before, the Crim Shop makes the best face mask. So if you ever see their stuff in TJ Maxx, Ross, Burlington, Marshalls, Pick it up and give their face mask a try. These are really, really good face masks. Okay, and the next thing I picked up from TJ Maxx. These got me when we were in line for the checkout, but these are the Mana brand, if I'm saying that correct. Um, the stainless steel straws. Stainless steel straws are trending like crazy right now just because you know they're good for the environment um these are fda approved stainless steel rust proof scratch proof um they don't have the metal odor or aftertaste they fit it says they fit most tumblers you get five pieces these were $4.99 these are really really long they had some that were shorter but it comes with the four straws and the brush cleaner I thought that was a really good deal, so I picked this up when we were in line to check out. Now, at Burlington, the first thing I got, I got two things from there as well. It was this little marble box that opens up. And I'm probably going to put this on my vanity to store makeup, but you could do anything with it. Um, this was $3.99 too. And it just says, girl, you are powerful. Go prove it to the world. And they had a bunch with different sayings. It's cardboard, but it looks, it has that marble finish. It's really, really nice. But like I said, this will probably go on my vanity to store excess makeup. And the next thing I got from Burlington, I was so surprised to see. I did show y'all this in the vlog. This is the um, Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water in Serene Green. And this was actually marked down on clearance for $7.99. And I was surprised to see this because this was the collaboration they did last summer with um, YouTuber Nicole Concilio. So I was really surprised to see these at Burlington, especially that they were marked down. So um, if you liked this collaboration, go check your Burlington because they have them on clearance. But yeah, that was all I picked up. But yeah, like I said, it's just going to be a, another lazy day kind of getting things done and organized around the house. But I'll kind of check in like I did yesterday and show y'all exactly what I'm doing. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do today, sorry for the glare, is I'm going to change my calendar from June to July. This little um, handy dry erase calendar I found on clearance at Walmart for $3.00. But I keep it right by the bedroom door. It's super, super handy because anytime I'm leaving the room, I can check and see, you know, what I have to do today, what I have to do this week. But honestly, really, really like this little calendar. So if you're looking for a good dry erase calendar, check your Walmart. Okay, I just wanted to show y'all a little behind the scenes of how I post for Poshmark. Literally just a backdrop on top of my dresser with the mannequin and then my ring light right here. Super duper easy. I literally only have this shirt and this dress to post, but I know if I don't just go ahead and post it, I'm going to let it just sit there and it's never going to get posted. So I'm going to go ahead and post these to Poshmark now. Okay, everything's on Poshmark and I'm looking at this Better Homes and Gardens. 4th of July um, magazine and it's full of recipes for the 4th of July and they have some pretty good stuff in here. What are some of your favorite 4th of July recipes? Drop them down in the comments below. Um, this video will be up a few days before so I'll have time to kind of look and see what everybody does or what everybody says. But yeah, I would like to do a video about like easy 4th of July recipes. 
Okay, so I'm just in the middle of dusting everything right now, and I just dusted off the dresser. And I wanted to show y'all the candle that I hauled, the Colombian cold brew coffee from Dollar Tree. My first one is almost gone, y'all. It smells amazing. It has the whole room smelling like Starbucks. Really recommend. Definitely going to have to buy some more of these. Okay, so I'm dusting off my vanity and cleaning out my acrylic drawers. The sheer amount of makeup that I have is disgusting. So, probably going to declutter some of this because it's overwhelming. Okay, this is everything that I am getting rid of. Um, pretty good that I got this much. Vanity is a lot more clear and well organized. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the vlog here. Just going to finish up cleaning. I have to shower, take out the trash, you know, nothing super exciting. So thank you so much for watching this week's vlog. I'll start a new one tomorrow for y'all. Make sure you subscribe if you are not subscribed already, and click the bell so that you are notified each time I upload a new video.